In today's video, we will show you how to preserve fruits that oxidize, just like a pro chef. You will see step by step how to protect avocado from browning. So let's go. First of all, here is how to distinguish ripe and overripe avocado. If you want to check if an avocado, for example, is ripe or overripe, the way to check that is to just pull off the little stem in it. And if it's green inside, the fruit is perfectly ripe. And if it's brown, this means that your avocado or any other fruit that has a stem is completely overripe. Some YouTubers advise you to use palpation to check your avocado instead of omitting the stem. Unfortunately, sometimes your fruit can be soft, but not ripe at all, or hard but ripe. So the good way to check is to pull off the stem. After this little trick, let's go now to the main trick of this video. How to keep avocado from browning. With a very sharp knife, cut your avocado in half. Be careful not to cut your hand. It can happen to the best of us. Even professional chefs can get knives accident. Open your fruit and take the help that has the core on it. Place it on the palm of your hand. And with the blade of your knife, remove the core. The next step is to take a saucepan. Place it on the cooking hub. Fill with water and bring it to a boil. Add some vinegar, not too much, one tablespoon should be enough. If the water starts quivering, put the fire down to medium. Now that your water is ready, poach the avocados for 10 seconds. By doing this, you deactivate the polyphenol, the enzymes responsible for the color changing into brown. Its job is to interact with phenols, which are simple, organic, chemical compounds that can be found in pretty much everything alive. The polyphenol oxidizes these phenols wherever it can. After the 10 seconds timer, collect the avocado with a skimmer and place it into cold water. As you can see, the fruit kept its beautiful bright color. Your fruit is now protected against oxidation. It will not turn brown anymore, even if you leave it on the table. From the beginning to the end of this video, we used one same avocado in order to show you the exact result you will get. Our goal is, and will always be, to give you tricks and tips that really work, and not just cheating and showing you nice and captivating videos to get views. Now you can keep your fruit in the fridge for a later use, or stock it in the freezer to keep it longer. At the restaurant, we use this same technique to preserve avocado, and use it later in a guacamole or in a good salmon tartare with avocado dices. And we do the same with all the vegetables, and fruits that get browned by oxidation. There you go. You have now learned how to preserve your fruits and veggies that oxidize because you can use this same technique for almost any vegetable or fruit that can be concerned with oxidation. If you have a vacuum sealer, just use it to expel the air out of the freezer bag. This helps to gain space in your freezer and decrease the chance of any potential oxidation. And here is the final result. After 48 hours in freezer, the avocado didn't change color. Once defrosted, it looks as green and fresh as before the freezing process. To make this video, we used avocado, but this technique may be used to preserve almost every fruit or vegetable that oxidizes. Fruit and vegetables that get brown or change the color when exposed to air and light. The very common of them are apple and quince. That's it for this video. If you like our content and you want us to continue sharing with you tips and tricks like this one, please subscribe to our channel, like the video, 
and let us know in the comments if you have any question. We will be happy to answer it.